In this movie I will explain you how you can create the catalog in the ETS5 software. First of all I have to know which hardware devices I have, so I have to check for example the reference number on the devices itself and I have an example here of a young child actor, an actor with number 2302.16 REGH M. So I know this number and I can um, copy this number and look online in the online catalog of Young if I can find some more information about it. So I'm going to this site of uh, Young itself and I'm looking up this number and I'm waiting for the results. So I have three results in the online catalog. I have one online catalog result, a media database result and one download result. First of all I have just a little look in the online catalog what kind of results I do have. So I see that indeed in KNX Schalt Actor and um, that's the one I really needed. So I'm going back because I want to download something, I'm going to download and I want to download the product software so I can import it in the uh, catalog of ETS5. First of all I see here there's also a kind of manual, I can download the manual also and when I see the manual, in this manual there's kind of more information about uh, how to find the KNX bus for example or how I can remove uh, parts of the device and so on. So this is rather hardware and then I have also product documentation. So I have um, the other information in Deutsch or in English. So I'm looking in the information in English of course. That's a two-gang switch activator. And the most important difference about this um, product documentation is that I can find some more software information. And software information for me is very important to know which are, for example, the functions who are um, have been programmed in this device because you know this is a decentral system. The KNX system is a decentral system. This means that in every device it has hit his own intelligence and um, every uh, manufacturer can choose which kind of functions he programmed in this device. And for example, I see here a lot of functions. For me, it's very important. Of course, the switching, the switching feedback timing function is interesting. And when I'm scrolling a little bit further, I see here the object table. And in the object table, I see a list of the kind of objects who are really used and I can use to program in ETS5. One bit, four bytes, and so on. For me, again, important basic functions are, for example, switching, but I can go a little bit further with staircase, with logical operation. I have also um, a bit further the um, value operating hour counter and so on. Doesn't matter, I can find a lot of information. This is 80 pages, so that's a lot, but that's not the thing I'm searching for this moment. I want to download something. So I'm um, seeing here ETS3, ETS4, 5, some more information. And I take the English version and I download here. It's kind it's, it's a, a file with uh, extension VD4. So this means this, uh, this file is, for example, uh, rather made for ETS4, but, but I can also import it in the ETS5. In the ETS5, the extension of the file will be KNXPROD, KNX product file. I'll show you. So I have downloaded this file and now I'm going to the ETS5. Uh, here in my catalog, I'm going to the catalog, I can find catalog here also in the workspace and normally this is empty so I have to start from zero and when I start from zero I can import uh, the downloaded file I just saw and you see here in ETS product files I can choose also the VD1, 2, 3, 4, 5 the older versions of um, this software files 
and components but the new version is the key annex PR, prod file it's um, an ETS5 five file so I'm choosing this anyway he can import it in ETS5 and he will uh, switch it I can choose English or German or I import all languages for example this time and then I can see when I have imported this uh, he will be mentioned in the list and I can see this is the one I just imported um, why is important something more is a topology for example in the topology you need this catalog because you have to import from the catalog to make your topology how your devices are connected to each other in one line for example but I will explain more about this in another movie.